I just came from a government event that had 2,300 people. Wow. 60% of those 2,300 people were us. So as an event planner that put on government contracting events, I said, what made this event so special? Now, I'm going to tell you all the truth, because don't ask me if you don't want the truth. They didn't teach nothing for us. Mm. So you got 60% of the people in this room bought these tickets, but nothing that you taught was actually for us. Mm. So I'm not sure if the people in the government space has gone, because, you know, if you went to anything federal, they are talking over your head, right. and you don't understand it. So you're like, why invest and waste my money if I don't understand it? But as I tell the SBA, when we put on events like this, it needs to be for us, by us, but it has to include us. Mm-hmm. And that's the key piece that's missing. What I love about your event, Dr. Travis, is, you know, I've been in this space for a long time. You would think, I'm not going to learn nothing. Every speaker that has gotten on that stage I done learned something. So even the people that's in the space that feel like, well, what more can I learn? You will always keep learning. Because the thing about the government, the crisis changes every year. And if you don't keep up with what's going on, they leave your butt behind. The government ain't stopping for nobody. Mm -hmm. So coming to events like this, I wish more of our people would show up, especially when it's led by us, because we're the ones that's actually communicating to us. Every time you ask them, did they learn something new? Every time, even me, I'm learning something new. We have to start supporting these type of events and stop supporting the ones that ain't for us because you're not learning anything. And then you're getting burned out. You're getting burned out because you're going to the wrong places. Yeah, yeah. I couldn't say it any better right there. Nah, go ahead and drop the mic. I'm done. 